Came out bussin', came out, came out on your cousin. I do all these words, then they daddy, but you love her, you in trouble. I'm the same, I'm gon' barber to it. That's your busy, it ain't. I went shopping, left it running, check my honey, check my. We watch cable and my auntie, cause my papa wasn't. But my uncle, other certain, Mr. Magic, Billy, Bash it, Mr. Magic, Billy, Bash it, Mr. Magic, Billy, Bash it. Miss me with that local vision, on the get it, check it. I'm not surprised, I'm on the rise, been on the ride. Let me the lie, just hold it down. All I require, just hold it down. They gon' talk you when we on the round. Be hating when feet on the ground. Got the legit with the beat on the couch. Came out buzzing, 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 came out buzzing. Wait, Chanel on my feet, yeah that's for on my seats. I be cool with the beast like Muhammad. Got your on the edge of her seat. She on that. I'm on the swear that edge of my V. And usually, I like repetitive V. I like the way that she moves. Quality, they look good to me. But I'm saying, girl, because I don't even cheat. That is a lie. I'm repetitive. I don't need a look, no. I don't need a seat. I don't need a peek. G5, G5. Repetitive G. I'm trying to get a cheese. I'm a boss. I'm with heavy B. I've been on tour. I see you. I told her. everyone it's the nba on 2k sports we're bringing it to you live this is brian anderson joined courtside by grant hill and clark kellogg our reporter tonight ali laforce we'll see the golden state warriors Taking on the Milwaukee Bucks. Oh, 
know, there was a time when Giannis wasn't too comfortable on catch and shoot jump shots. That's not the case these days, and that's a testimony to his hard work. The kick out, Curry. Clock at six. On the take. To the inside. And he was camped in the lane there. He gets a three second call. Ball. Kumpo outside. And the Bucks call time here. Top of the key. Here's Ana de Kumpo. Off the inbound. Giannis and Giannis throws it down. For the aggressive approach from Giannis, I like it. Not settling for the layup, instead, punching it on. That's the way you do it. To the paint. And it's hammered home Green. by Green. His playmaking is something to watch. Threading that pass right in there. Back to Middleton. Kicks it out to Ana de Kumpo. And here's Holiday. Pass to Middleton. The 15-footer. And no good. So Golden State will take it the other way. Green with the ball. Guarded now by Holiday. Right side Curry. And here's Durant. Outside Curry. Six to shoot. Beyond the arc. Golden State needs to get off a shot. Here's the break. Here's Portis. And it's going to be a goaltending call here, so they will count the bucket. Yeah, it was just a little late. I mean, he thought he got there, but the ref saw it otherwise. Thompson fires from way outside. The long distance three is buried. Well, I tell you what, Curry is such a tremendous perimeter shooter that I think his ability to set up teammates and his unselfishness are often underrated. Now here's Ana Kumpo. Back to Middleton. And it's going to be a three-second call. Golden State ball. And the Warriors with possession. They trail by one. Pass to Durant. Outside Curry. Puts it up from the high post. Oh, and that one had the right spin on it. It's good. Not just a three-point threat. Curry is also comfortable trying his luck from the mid-range. It's Holiday with a drive. Good work there as it goes. Bad idea leaving him open. He needs more defensive attention, not less. Here's Thompson. Durant for three. Two minutes remaining in the first. And here's Curry for three. It's hauled in by Portis. Tell you what, the defense was lucky there. I mean, leave him that open from range, he'll typically knock it down. And he gets that one. Otto Kupo's got six points. You know, inside Giannis's length really helps him get by the defense. Not much they can do to trip him up or slow him down. He's a force. Here's Milwaukee. Pass to Allen. Back to Anadokounmpo. And the jam by Anadokounmpo. <laughs> so sick, the vertical ability. That was flat out awesome. He has that effortless knack for getting to the hoop. Tell you what, you'd hate to be the guy having the responsibility of guarding him. And Milwaukee has possession. The Warriors getting their last shot to go. 
and the basket by Holiday. You know, Drew Holiday has so many great attributes, but I think maybe perhaps the best one is his mindset. He's even keeled, he competes at a high level, and he never backs away from a challenge. Now here's Curry. He's got five. Seven, Curry. Good. Seems like he can't miss right now, guys. I mean, completely in the zone this quarter. Here's Holiday. Takes it inside. Holiday. And Holiday powers it home. Boy, he's like an eel slipping into the paint through Holiday. Glides past the other guys and gets himself right to the bucket. Here's Middleton. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. About seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Outside Holiday. Seventeen seconds left in the first quarter. Nails it from beyond the arc. Holiday's got nine. Boy, from three-point range, Holiday can really be effective. Now, he's worked on that part of his game over the years and forces the defense, as a result, to have to come out and guard him at times. Sinks it from distance. They've been the more poised team tonight, and the score reflects that. Well, I like the way they're playing. A very smart first half. Quality shots, not wasting possession. I'm not sure whose fault that was, guys, but they need to get on the same page here. Two on the clock. And Ibaka lays it up and in. They played with fantastic energy from the opening tip. And, you know, when you've got a chance to put a team away early, you got to take it. And so it's Milwaukee earning this break in the action. Up 10. They've been aggressive in transition and find them. We welcome you back to second quarter action. Plenty of basketball left to play. But this one has been one sided so far. And taking a quick look here at the hustle stats for the Bucks, Fellas, the defensive pressure they've been applying has really been paying off. Turnovers and points. The other thing that's been effective so far tonight is their fast break. A lot of points coming on the run. Anytime Curry gets a look from deep, he's letting it fly. He's probably knocking it down, too. Time now to hear from our reporter, Allie LaForce. This Bucks team is arguably the most talented in franchise history. At the same time, the East has gotten tougher. So the Bucks are looking to improvise. Giannis said, quote, we're getting better, trying new things, changing our schemes. That's something we think is going to help us. Brian? Using the regular season to experiment, Allie. Interesting. Thank you. Here's Curry. Let's it go. And it's good. Off the back rim and in. Curry's got five points now this quarter. Connaughton goes in. Oh, a dunk and a foul! A powerhouse move! He's got a chance for one more at the line. Clay Thompson picks one up. Just over a minute has passed here in the second quarter. Thompson outside. Unloads. Shot is up. Here's Ibaka. Back to Connaughton. Knocked loose. Oh, it's stolen by Iguodala. And it's slammed in by Durant. Boy, with that long reach of his, so easy for KD to throw it down. Time called here. The Bucks decide to talk it over. Milwaukee in the lead. Here's Connaughton. Three shots, three baskets. Great efficiency so far. They're winning the battle down low by imposing their will. Yeah, it's really been quite a contrast. I like the way they're attacking the middle at their offensive end. To the middle. Here's Iguodala. And he makes no mistake. Slam dunk. The big time throwdown. Check him out. Keeps the grip on that rim after the finish. A little extra emphasis. Maybe that'll help them recapture their edge a little bit, guys. Chalk up two there. Lopez has got his first two points of the night. 
Well, he is so tough to deal with inside. Lopez just too big and too skilled. Outside Durant. All right, for those just joining us, we're almost two and a half minutes into the second. Here's Matthews. Six on the shot clock. Lays it up and in off the pretty assist. And now a 12-point Milwaukee lead. And force-feeding the ball inside. I mean, no reason to go away from what's working. And when you make five in a row in close like that, it also takes pressure off your perimeter guys, too. Here's Connaughton. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Two minutes. Knocked away. Curry with a seal. Down low. Here's Iguodala. Grant, it seems like each year, play in the NBA becomes a little more wide open and a little less physical. Yeah, it's definitely changed, B.A., what you look for in a player today. Now, if you're overly aggressive, you always will be in foul trouble and of little use to your team. So being able to control your aggression is how you survive in today's game. Now here's Kumpo. Give him eight points now. And he banks in the layup. Cupo's got 10. Hey, they're just getting pushed around inside. Yeah, you can't say that with enough emphasis. I mean, the defenders are just not being aggressive enough down low. You got to play with some physicality in the paint. Inside. And the jam by Cupo. And that's what happens when you don't take care of the ball. Hey, that makes the turnover hurt even more. What? You, you mean the throwdown at the end? I'll tell you what, fellas. I mean, the highlight shows are going to pain them even more. Here's Green. Green on and Green. it's hammered home by Green. And we think of Curry as a shooter first, but they're reminding us how good a passer he is. Allen with it. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. And the bucket is good. And how? I mean, they're taking this defense to task, taking them to school. Every one of their last 10 points have come in the paint. Thompson's shot is off. Five-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. And it's Allen who slams it home. Wow. That type of finish is just deflating right now for a team that's trying to make a comeback. Ouch. That's certainly a big-time finish right there. It was one big exclamation point, or maybe even a question mark. And, guys, I know there are a lot of questions right now defensively for this team. There's no doubt about that. Back to Portis. One second left. Driving inside. And then Portis with the dunk. Terrific find that time by Holiday. You get open. Drew will get it to you. And there wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. And here's Curry for three. Another three for Golden State. Boy, the unselfishness of Eagle Dollar is really admirable. A forward with excellent vision. He has a feel for when one of his guys is open. And that one's good. Middleton. And the Bucks lead by 13. They have no answer defensively inside. Yeah, and that's four straight field goals now they've allowed from point blank range. Can't happen. Stephen Curry. Now Holiday. He's got nine. To the middle. Here's Ana de Kumpo. And Giannis with the jam. Boy, that basketball IQ you see from Holiday, understated but consistent. So valuable, especially in these pick and roll sets where he just cuts up defenses. Andre Iguodala shot is good. Three straight buckets to start the half. This is how they wanted to come out and execute. Here's Allen. And there's the drive. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. That free throw good from Allen. 
And the Bucks making a change here. The line for the Bucks. That one misses. So it's the Warriors now. A 12-point game. Chris and Chris Middleton gets the whistle that time. Personal foul. That's his first foul. First team foul. For three, Durant. The kick out, Curry. Wesley Matthews. Shot clock at five. And here's Thompson for three. Pure three from three-point range. Three. Thompson's got six. A nice start to the second half. Just one miss in their first five attempts. Anadokounmpo outside. The ball's knocked loose. Curry with a steal. And the Warriors pushing it up now. Here's Durant. Thompson outside. Pass to Curry. Drives to the hoop. It falls again. He's now 8 for 12 from the floor. Curry does not just hurt you from deep. He is a clever finisher on the drive. Lethal at penetrating and finishing. Slams it down with two hands. Man, they're really getting aggressive now. Now's the time to do it. Keep attacking that rim. Excellent feed from Steph Curry. Ball timeout. Timeout called. Milwaukee. Yeah, Coach no doubt wants to use this timeout to review the matchups and maybe make some adjustments as well. And I agree. I think there's going to be a new wrinkle in their game plan when they come out of this timeout. And the Bucks making a change here. Milwaukee in the lead. Well, we're into the third quarter. Just over two and a half minutes played. the drive and a nice finish on the layup 10 points for him time and time again they're creating good looks from close range and even under pressure in close I think they've still done a good job maintaining concentration and converting the opportunities two minutes remaining the third two minutes pass to Durant And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. That's his first personal foul. That's on Brooke Lopez. Second team foul. Katie is so good at drawing contact. You might remember now they changed the rules on that rip move that he perfected. And both free throws good for Durant. He's as solid as it gets from the line. I mean, give him the opportunity. He's cashing in on those. Outside Holiday. A minute 39 left in the third. Just five to shoot. Driving to the basket. Here's Lopez. Green with the defensive effort. The Warriors trailing. Here's Durant. And it's Durant with the finish. Now, this is impressive. Durant showing you all of that creativity with that. Here's Connaughton. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. Pass to Thompson. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Curry. And now it's just a two-point Bucks lead. They've been pretty lax with their perimeter defense, giving up a lot of three-pointers. And their defensive rotations have been non-existent. Very consistent tonight at the offensive end. Right there, he helps fuel the fire. Outside Curry. Milwaukee foul. Drew Holloway. That's his first personal foul. Third team foul. First one falls for him. At the line for the Warriors. So many of the hopes for this team rest on Curry's shoulders. It's an immense responsibility, but he carries it out with fire and optimism. And so Curry nails both of them. Milwaukee with the ball. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. And Holiday, here we go. Ooh, Thompson with the block. And a deep three from Curry. Sinks it. What range from downtown. Curry's got 10 points in just the second half. Here's Allen. They shoot again. Nice move. And 
and it's good on the layup. Allen's got seven. In a tight game, they wanted to make sure of that possession. And here's Curry. The shot's good. Stephen Curry. And the Warriors lead by one. They fought so hard to get themselves in a position to win this game. Extremely impressive was the rally they made. I mean, we'll see how much their comeback might have taken out of them. And, and we'll see if they... Stephen Curry getting it done for the Golden State Warriors. Moving the rock and looking for a shot. It's clear he's in a good rhythm. We'll be right back after this word. And with three quarters behind us, we'll start the fourth in what is still anybody's ball game. Here's Anadokounmpo. Now here's Holiday. Portis for three. And the shot is good on the assist by Holiday. And neither side able to take control of this game. Yeah, at this rate, it's going to come down to a photo finish. Back to Anadokounmpo. Just outstanding. He hits again, and he's still a perfect nine for nine. And a look at how the hustle game has been going for Milwaukee. Boy, they're hounding, harassing effort to the defensive end. Very impressive. And they forced quite a few turnovers as a result. Another thing, they've not only caused a bunch of turnovers tonight, they've turned most of them into points. Great job drawing the foul. And almost converted the shot as well really as close as you can get to an and one right there. He almost had it. Portis outside. Anadokounmpo outside. The second effort. And it's good on the lay-in. Anadokounmpo's gotten four this quarter. <laughs> They're just taking what the defense gives them. And right now, that's the interior. Well, once they recognized the advantage they had inside, it made a lot of sense just to continue to attack that area. To the paint. Here's Iguodala. And the shot goes in. Can't ask for a better look with the game in the balance. Allen with it. To the inside. Anadokounmpo. Good setup. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. Anadokounmpo's got 22. Boy, in his relatively short career, Giannis has figured out just about every way to get the ball in the basket, even with the guy draped all over. And keeping us updated from the sideline, Ali LaForce. I was able to listen in on what Steve Kerr had to say to the team. He told them, we've got to protect the rim with everything we've got. If we cut down on their easy looks inside, we've got them. It might mean more room for their perimeter shooters, but that's a trade-off he's willing to risk. All right, back to you guys. Good job there, Allie. Thanks. Back to Curry. It's stolen by Holiday. And the Bucks pushing it up now. We're in the fourth quarter here, just under two and a half minutes gone by. Shot clock at six. There's the drive. And Holiday powers it home. Some nasty handles from Holiday, leaving the defense shaking its head and all. Outside Curry. Pass to Durant. Back to Green. Hey, in six attempts, he's made five. Talk about efficiency. Boy, that's an example of Durant's basketball IQ and awareness, both platinum level. It's Holiday with a drive. Misses from short range. Now the Warriors with it. Trailing by four. The kick out, Curry. Back to Iguodala. 
Just caught that pass in full stride on his way to the big slam. What nice timing on these jumps. He's somewhat on the small side for a power forward, but he just never gives up. Back to out of the Kumpo. Uses the glass on the layup. Out of the 